All right, I think what I'm gonna do is build a quick little, or maybe we go back down in the cave. Let me do that. And, I, oh, jeez, please don't hit me. Oh man, please no. What's up guys, I am back with another video and as you can see, I'm gonna be starting something that I've never actually done before and it is going to be a survival island let's play. So yeah, this should definitely be fun, I've always wanted to try this and I just never really ended up doing it. So I thought, why not go ahead and just start this Let's Play and we'll see how it does. So I also never do this, but if this video can maybe hit like 50 likes, then that'll let me know that I should continue doing the Let's Play. Basically, I know you guys could easily hit 50 likes, so if it doesn't, that goes to tell me that I shouldn't continue this Let's Play. So 50 likes and I'll make like part 2 and all the other parts after that. So. As you can see here, uh, I'll link the video in the description of how I got this seed. And I'll also leave, well actually you can see right here, the name is Sky Shard, which is a little bit weird. Normally it's like a long random number, but it's called Sky Shard. Uh, make sure to have fine balance seed checked. And then the world size is classic. The biome scale is small. And I think that is basically everything you need to know. By the way, I'm playing on the PS4 and I'm on the latest edition. It's 1.86. So yeah, I think that is everything. I have my game on normal difficulty and let's go ahead and start it up. All right, here we are. So it looks like the seed worked. We are all good. We're on an island. And yeah, I believe there's like multiple islands around the area and there's like a big uh, piece of land that's like up at the top right hand corner of the map, I believe. And there's a village up there. So I watched the video briefly. I just wanted to find at least a decent seed because like I said, I've never done a survival let's play before. This is all completely, or not a survival one, but a survival island let's play. So this is all completely new to me and yeah, I have no idea where to start. I, I think I've watched maybe one other person uh, play a survival island just so I know like the rules and stuff because I thought you weren't allowed to leave the island, but I guess you can. So yeah, I'm just going to start by getting all of this wood. We're going to replant a bunch of trees. As you can see, we have plenty of trees here as it is. And there's a bunch of other islands. Whoa. Yeah, is that the... Yeah, that's the top right-hand corner of the map. There's like a giant piece of land over there with a... Um, with a village so here's the thing there is that big piece of land but i think what i want to do to make it just feel more like a survival island let's play is i think i just want to like make my house on this small little island and just do everything there i really don't want to be at that big piece of land too much because that really doesn't look like an island to me okay so yeah i'm just gonna grab a bunch of these maybe i should have had a starter chest Nah, we don't need one. We're good. We're good enough, alright? We don't need one. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna collect all of these seeds so we can plant them and get wheat. Let me collect that. <laughs> so we can get wheat and uh, make bread and stuff. Because that'll be, like, our main food source until we at least reach that island over there. That big piece of land. So we could get all of the food from the village. So yeah, guys, uh, I'm going to go ahead, just chop down a bunch of these trees, make a crafting table and stuff, and maybe we could go out and adventure and just basically discover the entire map, see what everything, like what there is to go and check out, and then I'll come back here, maybe we can make a small little starter house. I do want to also try to possibly make a mine so I could get a bunch of iron. So that is the main objective for this first episode we're gonna possibly make a really small starter house and get a bunch of iron and stuff so i'll see you guys when i am ready to go out and explore some of the other islands okay guys i gathered up a few things made a crafting table and stuff i made a boat so we could go out and explore and i do want to mention we do have quite a few amount of animals here we have at least more than one cow and more than one pig so we're going to be able to breed them so that is definitely very helpful Anyway, uh, I think what I'm going to do is make a small little 
garden so we could plant all of our wheat because I feel like I do want to like stay here on the starter island. I don't know, maybe we'll make a house over there or wherever, but I want to be at least on an area that actually looks like an island. I don't want to be over there because that just seems really big. So uh, I don't know, maybe let me know guys if you would like me to explore, or I guess I am going to explore over there, but let me know if you want me to build my house over there. Or if you want me to build my house on one of these smaller islands. Because like I said, this is the first time I've ever done uh, a survival island let's play. So I have no idea like what would be the proper way of doing this. Would it be to stay on the smaller islands or would it be to just find the biggest island like that and just stay over there. So yeah, I'm going to put a bunch of dirt in the water and make a small little starter garden so it could plant this food. And then I'll go out with my boat and I'm going to explore some of the other islands and see what there is to check out. So I'll see you guys when I, you know, I guess I'll just show you this. Um, no reason to like skip over it. I guess this is kind of like part of it. Maybe you guys want to see this. <laughs> so yeah, let me see how many I have five. Oh, okay. I thought I had more. Oh, I need to make a hoe as well. Let me go ahead and do that. Alright, two, three, four, five. Alright, let's go ahead and plant that. And let me see if I could get any more. We gotta make sure to replant these trees as well. Okay, guys, I just noticed we do have sugar cane on this island, so we're gonna be able to plant that. Um, but I did get two more seeds. I also, as you can see, or as you can hear, there are some uh, zombies that I'm hearing. So it looks like there might be a little bit of a cave right underneath this island. So we could possibly check that out. But yeah, let me see. Let me go ahead and plant this. And then let me also get a piece of... Oh wait, we have, uh... We have that right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and plant those. And my hunger hasn't went down yet, so that's good. So what I'm gonna do... Let me grab this. I'm gonna go on my boat... And we're going to go out and just check out some of the closer, like the close islands. We're not going to check out any of the ones that are like really far. We just want to see what's around us real quick. All right, let me go ahead and put this in there. Okay, so we have a ocean monument right there. So uh, I'm not really sure how like, oh, there's another one over there. They don't really seem too special to me. I know there's a bunch of blocks of gold in them, but that's about it. So, uh, I don't know if I'm really even gonna explore those. I might just explore it for the video, but other than that, I could kind of care less about the ocean monuments. They don't really seem too cool to me, I guess. I don't know. Alright. We haven't traveled too far. We have another big island here. I don't know if this looks any different from... Maybe it's more updated since, like, that guy uploaded this video. But uh, I don't know if I remember seeing any of this. Like I said, I kind of just like watched it briefly to see if it would be a seed that I would be willing to start my first let's play on, survival let's play on, and it looks pretty cool. So everything that he basically talked about, I have like, I have no idea what to expect, basically. All I know is there's that big island with a village and that's about it. So let's see what we got over here. I'm not sure where are all of like the uh, shipwrecks are. I haven't seen any yet. But yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure eventually we'll come across some. Okay, looks like we got a cave here. So I think what I'm gonna do is start here. I don't really like how this is in my hand. It's kind of distracting, but uh, let me collect this coal and we do have to go mining. So yeah, like I said, once again, the main um, the main thing we're going to be doing in this video, the main objective is to build a little house, a little bit of a shelter, and go mining to try to get some iron. Sounds like there's a zombie outside. Okay, it looks like, um, maybe we could go down an adventure in there. It is really dark. Let me see, where's my gamma at? Oh, it's at 60. Let me go ahead and turn that up to maybe like 80. I don't want to turn it all the way up. Because I still want the game to look cool when I'm playing. I don't want it to be like completely bright. But for the purpose of the video, I'm going to try to adjust the settings so you guys could see this just as well as I'm able to see it. Let me craft some stone tools. And then we'll go down further in that direction where that zombie is. Actually, let me get some more stone. And then, um, yeah, we got to look for iron. It is getting dark. Maybe... We'll, we'll probably... Is that a... 
I thought I saw a creeper. Maybe we could just travel around in there until the sun comes back up. So I'll see you guys when I have enough stone, a bunch of stone tools, and I also need to make some torches. All right, what have we got over here? Oh, that's a zombie. That's what we got. Oh, wait. I was thinking I had like an iron, an iron uh, sword already. I was like, where the heck is my sword? All right. Oh, here, let me organize this a little bit better. Have these side by side so it's a lot easier to access. We do got some more iron here, so let me collect this. I hear a lot of enemies, though. Hello? All right, we got more iron here. How much we got so far? We got nine. Let's collect this. Those enemies are really annoying. They're, like, really loud. Nice. Oh, what's up? Please let me get that shovel. No. What the heck? I've never... By the way, guys, I have never seen a zombie holding an enchantal enchant enchantal what an enchanted shovel before that was the first time i've actually ever seen that that was actually okay too bad i didn't get it it let me know guys if there's any special way of like a higher chance of getting that type of stuff or if it's just like you get lucky and he might drop it because i have no idea all right i think what i'm gonna do is build a quick little or maybe we go back down in the cave let me do that and i oh geez please don't hit me oh man Please, no. Come on, where's that cave? Where's the cave? I think I'm just gonna dig. No, I'm not. Come on. Cave, cave, cave. Oh, that was close. Don't come in here. All right. I think we're safe. I do not want to die on the first day. <laughs> Let me eat this. I am on two and a half hearts. And I'll see you guys when I am ready to go out and leave this place. So yeah, we'll head back up there, go exploring a little bit more, and we'll see what else there is to check out. Okay, so we have that giant thing over there. It looks like just a full island of stone. So I guess if we ever need cobblestone, we could just go over there, I don't know. Or just go mining. All right, looks like there's not much over in that direction. Let me check out my map, make sure I explored everything. Oh, okay, so that is the edge of the world. Keep in mind, this is a small biome, so I don't think I could actually go further over there, which really doesn't bother me. I always, uh, the last time that I actually f went full out and played survival was when the maps were this small, so it doesn't really bother me that this map is a small-sized map, so it should be fun either way. And yeah, we still have plenty to explore, and I do still want to, oh geez, I still want to see if there are some shipwrecks lying around because those are always cool to go ahead and explore all right let me kill this creeper so it doesn't sneak up on me oh geez all right we're good he's dead now where's my bow i don't remember where i put it we do have a sea turtle there i do want to know exactly what those are good for I know you can make like a sea turtle helmet and that's it. That's all I know those are good for. So let me know guys uh, if it is worth breeding these sea turtles or not because I have no idea like how good they actually are. Oh, I want to pick up this egg. What could I? Eh, I'll drop that. So yeah, let me know if or just let me know all of the things you could actually do with sea turtles. That'll be very helpful because I have no idea like anything about them. Okay, there's my boat. Looks like there's a pig in it. No biggie. <laughs> so, yeah. Is he actually in it? I think he's actually in it. What are you doing? Can I help you? <laughs> Is he actually... He's actually in my boat. He's just chilling in my boat. <laughs> what the heck? Alright, where did we start out at? We have to go back this way. I think that's our main island right there. Let me go and check out my garden. And yeah, I want to just find a pretty decent sized island so we could make a small, simple starter house. I do need to collect some more wood as well. Is he still? Oh man, we actually have a pig on our boat. Let me, uh, oh no. Let me go in. How did I? Okay. What's up, dude? You just chilling on the boat, huh? <laughs> what the heck i've never had this happen before i've never witnessed this maybe it's part of a new update or maybe i just got lucky that a, a pig went on my boat 
All right, is this our main island? I think. Oh yeah, we mined our trees down here. Where is our garden? Well, we have a nice little friend that's gonna be on our boat with us for future adventures, I guess. I don't know if he's gonna stay there or if he's just gonna hop off whenever he feels like it. Where's my uh? Where's my garden? Should be over here. Okay, yeah, it's over here. Nothing grew out yet. So I'm gonna, I don't know. I guess it's not the, that big of a deal. We do need food, but it's not a lot. So it's no big deal. Um, so yeah, let me go ahead. Uh, if I had one more piece of white wool, I can make a bed. Is there any sheep on here? Any sheep? We still have to check that out. Uh, I I didn't remember seeing, like, I don't remember seeing that in the dude's video, so I'm not sure if that's new or if I just didn't see that when I watched it. But yeah, I think what I'm going to do, first let me eat, and I'm going to craft a bunch of iron stuff, like iron armor, so I'm going to cook up all of the iron that I have, and I'll see you guys when I am ready to go out and explore a few more things. Maybe we could go to the main island. I know there's a village over there, so we could check that out. Oh. Well, isn't this just great? Now it's- oh wait, actually it could be. Our crops might grow faster, but it's raining now. Ah oh, man, great. I'm just standing out here in the open, in the rain. Wonderful. So yeah, maybe this will grow faster, I have no idea. Is that how Minecraft works? Does uh, rain actually affect how fast your crops grow? I don't know. Alright, do we have any more? We do have one seed. Let me try planting this. All right, boop and boop. Okay, so let me know if you guys are enjoying this new series so far. Uh, give me some feedback on how I'm doing because I've only ever made, I think I mentioned this before, one survival let's play ever on my channel so far. And that was, that was actually quite a while ago since episode one. So let me know how I'm doing, guys. Maybe I'm talking too much. Maybe I'm just not showing enough. I have no idea. I always want to try to make this like these series as enjoyable as possible so yeah just let me know how i'm doing and just give me some feedback on maybe things i could improve on so let me go ahead and just start making some armor maybe i should have made the chest plate first that's like the most important but we did make some boots and stuff and a helmet i'm gonna continue waiting for this it looks like we got 15 and 3 so that's 18 so we have 8 there and then we have seven. All right. Yeah, we should have enough. Definitely. Okay. Just barely, actually. I think we have like two left over. So I'm going to continue waiting for all of this. And I'll see you guys when I have my full set of iron armor. Oh, guys, look. There's a sheep right there. I think uh, what I'm going to do, we're going to have, I think, three pieces of iron ingot left over. We have eight there, two. We need seven, so we'll have three left over. So I'm going to make some shears so we don't actually have to kill the sheep. And then I'll have enough wool to make a bed. All right, guys, our pig is still in the boat. I'm not sure if he's going to stay here the entire time. But, I mean, oh, what's up? <laughs> I guess it's kind of cool that he's here. Never experienced this before, so it's definitely cool to experience this for the first time <laughs> what's up bro oh man he's just looking at me okay i think this is the main island let me check my map yeah because it's like a a winter uh biome as you can see it is pretty big i don't really consider this an island but might as well check it out since it is part of the world anyway all right doesn't look like there's too much here is that a what is that is that what the heck is that like an igloo <laughs> I actually kind of want to check that out. Let's see what that is. Or is that part of like one of those other icy biomes? Don't really know the names of them. But uh, let me check this out. See if it's anything special. All right. Let's hope there's like no enemy in it or anything. Oh, this is something. What is this? Whoa. I've never found one of these before. It's like an igloo. There's a bunch of redstone in there. Do I want to go in here? Is it a trap? There's a bed, furnace, crafting table. Huh. Let me know if you guys have ever, like, found one of these before. Alright. Are there any traps? Because there is... There's some redstone torches in here. Nothing in there. Seems like just a nice little home. J 
Just in case if you don't have one. Huh. That's cool. Let me stack this. And this. You never know when you might need more than one. And I can't really pick that up. We could always find redstone though. Okay, I'm gonna head over in this direction and try to find... Oh wait, is it over there? No, I believe the uh, village is over here. I don't know though. I guess that's one good thing. Uh, I don't exactly know where the village is. So we'll go out and try to find it together. I could see the village from here. So yeah, I was just on the wrong side. It looks like a really big village too. So this should be pretty cool. Maybe there's a blacksmith. I don't know. But uh, we should definitely be able to get some food from here. As long as there's carrots, then we're good. Because I actually really like carrying carrots on me. They're really easy to grow and it's a pretty good food source. I think it's like two bars that it fills up. So it's not too bad. And you could always get an unlimited uh, abundance of it because you could replant them. So I think it's a pretty good food to have on you. All right, let's see. Yep, I see carrots. And is that a blacksmith right here? That's a butcher. Oh, jeez, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> I thought I kicked him for a second. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I don't see a blacksmith here. So there's not going to be any, like, goodies we could find. But we do have food. So is there anything I could... Oh, yeah, let's drop that piece of granite. I don't know how that got back in there. Uh, I do just want to collect some carrots first. And... Yeah, maybe we could just, uh... To save some time, we could possibly just make our starter house on this main island. Next to this village. And when we uh, get all settled down and stuff, we could grab any food that we need and we'll go out and make our house on one of the actual like smaller islands. Kind of feel like that would be the uh, better thing to do since it is still like survival island. All right, let me go ahead and eat or let me just eat this and yeah, I'll start making a small simple house. Nothing too crazy and I'll see you guys when I gather up enough wood to start making one, I guess. Guys, I want to feel like I'm more, like, I, I just want it to feel like there's nothing around me. I don't want to be near this giant island, honestly. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to get on my boat. I'm going to try to find a more secluded area, just where there's, you can't see anything around me. And then I'll start building a starter house, because I still, I want it to feel like it's still a survival island let's play. Because I think that's pretty cool. So, yeah, I'll see you guys when I find an island that I like. I'm going to grab my bed too. I do need to clear something out of my inventory. And I'll let you guys know when I find a place that I actually like. Okay, I believe this... Well, actually, that island right there isn't the one we started at. I think that one over there is the one we started at. So I think what I'm going to do is just make my house on that island. Or did we start on this one? No, it was that one. But I think I want to start on this one. This looks pretty good. Let me see, this might... Oh, okay, I think this is... Yeah, this is the one I started on. Okay, so I'm back at the island we started on. I think it would just be best to make our house on here. So, let's see. What side should we make it on? Maybe on this side? Got a bunch of food here because <laughs> of the wolves. I think we should make it right... Ooh, okay, right here. We'll make it right here. So, yeah, let me make a chest. Store all my stuff. It's gonna, yep, there it is. And yeah, I'm just gonna, I don't have that much wood on this island. That's the thing. So I'm gonna have to use my wood wisely. Maybe we could just grab that wood over there. We got a bunch of trees on that side as well. Okay, so let me store all the stuff I don't need. Collect all the other wood I will need. And yeah, I'll let you guys know when I am ready to build. Okay, guys, I think I have some sort of an idea that I want to do. So first off, I want to make the house kind of a little bit raised off of the ground. So maybe we can have a staircase going up right here, a little like a porch or deck, and then the main house will be over there. And then we can have the staircase going down to the dock area. So I'm going to get some planks. And I think what I'm going to do is start with the dock and then we'll flow it into the house. So the dock will be right around, huh, let's see. Yeah, we'll make it right here. And we'll do four blocks wide. And then, 
yeah, we'll uh, continue it on from there. So actually, we have to have two blocks of space to walk, and then the sides will be like upside down stairs with the regular oak wood going up. So let me bring this out a little bit more. Or we could make it, I'll make it three blocks wide, like this. And then we'll have this piece coming out. And we'll have like a stair at the end. And this is, this will be where we have our, our boat like parked. So let me get my boat. And we'll have it over here next to our dock. So it's going to be similar to this little piece of sand here. It's just going to be made out of wood and it's going to be our dock. So yeah, a nice little starter dock. Nothing too crazy. And it should turn out pretty cool looking. Oh dang, I actually landed on it. All right. So let me make a stair and put it on the edge over there. What the heck? <laughs> What's up? Why is he turning his head away from me? What are you doing? <laughs> oh man. Okay, so yeah, if we go in the water, we'll be able, well, either way, we're able to go up. Huh. Actually, I need to raise this up one block. Okay, let me add an extra layer on this. We have to raise it up one block. All right, guys, I'm currently going to sleep right now, and I think I have to dock somewhat the way that I want it. So this is what it looks like. Very simple, not too much to it. Added some upside down stairs along the side. We have fences here. I decided to use birch slabs on here because I'll probably use birch for the trim on the roof of the house. And that we just have this where we could park our boat and fish off of. So let me go ahead and get our boat a little bit closer. Whoops. Okay, perfect. <laughs> just got our pig in there, just chilling. And yeah, then I want to add maybe like a staircase going up right here, leading to a deck. And then we'll have like our main house and it'll all be lifted off the ground. So uh, that is going to be the next step. So let me go ahead and delete some of this dirt and stuff so we can add our stairs. So I'll see you guys when I get a little bit more done. I'm getting an idea of how the house is turning out. So right here is going to be we walk up and it's just going to be the deck right here. And I also added some dirt blocks to kind of cover this part up so we don't have to continue bringing the wood down. So we might add some space down under there or we might not. Although this is just the part where the deck is going to be so we don't necessarily need to add anything down there. All right, so let me make some more wood and then i need to make some more stairs ouch i don't know how that hurt me but okay and then some more wood okay so let me go back over here we're gonna make a similar design to that so we're gonna do this and then this and then we got to here we'll add some blocks of dirt and then we'll bring this up three blocks okay and then i think what i'm gonna do is maybe just add another section just one more section and then we'll stop it right here in this corner okay so i think i do want to continue bringing this dirt over so we don't have to bring the wood all the way down okay and then we'll add this okay so let's see how this looks i think it's, I think it's looking pretty good Add one more up there. So yeah, just another little update. This is where the deck is going to be. Let me extend this so you guys could see it a little bit better. Okay. Then we'll enter the house over here. Probably like right here on this edge. So I'll bring another block up. And this will be like the actual house. Or should we bring it over? I think we should bring it over one more section. And then we'll have the house another little update so this is the deck right now is and that is going to be leading into the house i'm actually really liking how it's turning out so far so you just walk up here you go to the left and this is where you enter the house i'm going to bring it out a little bit further towards that side and then i'm going to have a little piece jutting out and then i'm going to just wrap it around it's going to be like a rectangle with some pieces jutting out on each side so honestly there's not too much more to do the only problem is uh there's not that much wood to collect i'm probably have to, gonna have to go 
Actually, all of these just regrew. But I am going to have to go and possibly just go on another island to get a bunch of wood. So I don't have to keep replanting these. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I just picked up leather. Did the cow, like, fall off that tree or something? Oh, man. <laughs> okay, so yeah, guys. I think what I'm going to do is just go on a different island like... Maybe that one over there. No, there's one. Okay, that one over there. And let me make one more axe just in case. I'm just going to collect as much oak wood as I can until probably like my axes break. So I'm going to do that and I'll see you when I have all my wood and I do a little bit more to the house. What? Did you say no? I guess he doesn't want me to do it. Oh, well, let's go ahead and go to this other island. I am mining down like one more tree. And then I think that should be enough oak wood for now. So I have two stacks and just like eight right there. Okay. So now I just remembered, I think I want to use some spruce wood for the roof, like the main roof of my house. And we'll have the trim as birch wood. So let me collect some more birch just in case. And then we have to go and get some spruce wood. Okay, guys, I also collected some more birch wood. So, I think what I'm going to do is just continue bringing up the walls of my house. I'm not really going to worry about the spruce wood quite yet. Okay. Let me hop back on. And I'm just going to push the walls back in that direction. So, I'll see you when I uh, get more of that done. Okay, guys. I thought I'd update you again. This is just like a few seconds later. All right, it was like two minutes. But, uh, yeah. I just want to show you how this is going to be. So maybe we could bring the door out right here. So we'll make this a little bit wider. So it'll be two blocks right there. And then, so yeah, we're gonna bring this piece out a little bit. Then we're gonna bring it back in like this part and we're gonna wrap it all around. And yeah, we'll do this side. We're gonna be doing the same thing to the other side that we're gonna top it all off at the roof. And that's probably all I'm gonna do in this video. I won't do the interior. Maybe we could do that in the next video because I have been recording for a while so far. So yeah, I'm just going to continue bringing up the rest of these walls. We're going to top it off with the roof and then we'll leave it at that for episode one. So I think I'm going to end it here. So this is what I got done so far. And we could just continue the house in another video because I feel like getting the entire house done is going to take a little bit longer than I thought. Probably at least another hour. At least getting the exterior where I want it. So this is what we have so far. I am just going to end it here. And in episode 2, we should be finishing the house. And we'll do whatever else that I guess we could do in episode 2. Once again, give me some ideas on what else I should do for uh, future episodes. And then once again, if this video reaches 50 likes, then I'll go ahead and make episode two for this let's play so i'm just gonna leave it here so if you guys did enjoy be sure to please leave a like subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in hopefully part two later i'm alone i'm a broken home i gave you all the bricks that i own and know i'm letting go i'm breaking these walls down breaking these walls down if you want it and shouldn't fly to home but if you wanna travel, then go alone Yeah, what's the point in us?